question or on the other side of that some sort of inaccurate conception. Other than that, please do your best to enjoy yourselves and avoid the speech. And now, please welcome direct from the middle of nowhere, Corey fucking Taylor. motherfucker on the schedule and I was like yes and don't get me wrong I love all cities equally I uh I, I, I you know I, we just played the city uh, about a few days ago I like I like I like New York I love New Jersey this is This is why, and this is why, and I'm gonna let you in on a little fucking secret. Every fucking city, every city has a certain attitude. You know what I'm saying. You know, Boston, Boston's got that fucking attitude. It's like, oh, fuck back. <laughs> New York, New York has that attitude. It's just like, oh, what's going on? <laughs> New Jersey's just like, oh, so fucking ready for this! And I love that. And that's why I've always, always, always fucking loved coming back to Jersey, man. Is everybody ready to have a good time with me tonight? Your sign's upside down, man. There you go. Oh, it says happy birthday, Corey. You're 24 hours late. Yes, I turned 38 yesterday, and uh, I gotta be honest, I, you know, 37, it was alright, I turned 38, I got up and I was like, what the fuck is this? What happened? What happened to my knees? This, uh, what the hell is going on here? It's old, getting old is terrifying to most people. I'm the asshole who gets excited when I find gray shit in my beard. I'm serious, like I swear to God, I was, look, I grew a beard, I just shaved it yesterday, but yet, like, fucking 24 hours ago, I had an Irish afro coming out of my face. And it was bright fucking red, except for, like, these little patches of gray. And I ran into my wife, and I was like, look at this shit! Look at that fucking shit! And she is like, what the hell is wrong with you? I was like, but look! I am, uh, it's an absolute honor, privilege, and pleasure to be here with you motherfuckers tonight. I am, uh... some ground rules for this show. I know there's a lot of people who've probably been following it on YouTube and there's probably a lot of people who are like, what the fuck is this guy gonna do for two and a half hours? Let me explain to you what I'm not going to do, okay? Number one, there will be absolutely no nudity. You, you have no idea. This all 
Looks like a train wreck at this point. <laughs> this really honestly looks like a fucking, it looks like a tourist's guide to Civil War battlefields at this point, all right? It's not pretty, it's not attractive, and you should all thank my wife that she likes me, because I do it every day, okay? So that's one. Number two, number two, there will be little to no dancing involved. No, try, no I, guys, I look like I've been shot with a fucking arrow when I'm dancing them. I don't know what that is. That's my only move now. Like, when I was young, I'm sure that I could dance something. Now, I just, like, I hear the music and I'm like, hey, what the fuck? I, like, I look like I'm looking for change in the driver's seat for no other reason than that's just instinct. I go right to the foot. It's not attractive. Um, and number three, and this is most important, I will not lie to you tonight. And that is my promise. That is my promise to each and every one of you. Now, this is what we're going to do. The first part of this show, I'm gonna talk a bunch of shit. And about a million fucking Google alerts will fly up on the internet. Because apparently now, every time I open my mouth, like, Google alert, Corey Taylor hates babies. I never fucking said that, ever. I love babies. Not ugly babies. I will run my mouth pretty much until I feel like I'm done running my fucking mouth, and then I will pick up the New York Times best-selling book. 